So, here we have the new i5 SSD 3 pound Veo Z laptop with 4 gigs of RAM. I've had this laptop for now 5 months and it's easily the best laptop I've ever had. It has HDMI, VGA, 3 USB ports. It's able to play games like Call of Duty Modern Warfare 2 and uh, you know, hook up to monitors. It's it's pretty much, you know, all with 3 pounds. It's one hell of a laptop. I have the 1600 by 900 screen and I think I'm actually pretty happy I got this one over the 1080p. The so most websites come up very small, even when you increase the uh, to the Windows size to 125%. And uh, yeah, a lot of the websites are still very small, and uh, I, most of the time I find myself increasing website at the, like the size of the font. So let's see some of the things about this laptop. Um, it can get pretty hot during gaming, but it it never really feels hot on the lap, and uh, the fan. It, it can get loud if you're in a very quiet room, but it, it's really never that loud. If music is playing or if you have headphones on, it's it's not that big. It can it definitely pushes out a lot of air, and up to I'd say this far away from the laptop, you can feel some serious heat during gaming. Um, other things, see the keyboard is great. It has um, I found it at one thing about the new Z is that uh, the touchpad is smaller, and I don't like this so much. Another poor thing is the volume is now at the front. Um, see the uh, the wireless switch uh, is actually also right here, and it's pretty annoying that it is oh, camera going out of focus. It's pretty annoying how the wireless sensor is so easy to hit. Sometimes you might just be moving your hand near the laptop, and we might switch it off, and then spend five minutes trying to figure out what happened to the internet. See, other things, this laptop feels very flimsy, but uh, it's actually quite tough. And for the, it fell two times in a row from about uh, five feet onto this stone floor here. And uh, this is the first time it ever fell, but it was actually about last week ago. And uh, it's put actually a metal dent. I don't know if you can see over there, but this part of it got dented. And uh, it looks pretty shabby on some ends. Uh, it's all scraped up around the edge. And the screen uh, housing has a few tiny cracks. It's pretty hard to see. But uh, overall, I had to say after two fallings on the ground, this computer is pretty damn sturdy and I have no idea how it managed to dent a piece of metal in here while not doing anything to the screen. Overall uh, I've been playing game pretty much every game from uh, Starcraft 2 to uh, Call of Duty Modern Warfare 2. I have some other videos posted of games being played but this laptop handles everything. It handles Starcraft 2 being open with Visual Studio, 3D Studio, Max, you know three browsers with 30 tabs in each one. It's it just one hell of a laptop and uh, I usually use the speed mo uh, actually I usually use uh, st stamina but uh, or speed. I never use auto since some applications don't like to be switched and the laptop I find sometimes crashes. Also sometimes in speed the laptop when you put it asleep it crashes and this usually only happens about once every one or two weeks. But uh, and stamina does also but once above every like once every two weeks so <laughs> it's a little better. But uh, overall, the battery isn't as good as the old Z. It's uh, five, It's around four hours, I'd say. Four hours. Like some, You can get four and a half, but it's it's really not realistic. Also, um, it's great because you can have a second hard drive. I have a second hard drive, a 320 uh, SATA hard drive in this laptop. All you need to do is get the th uh, standard ThinkPad uh, T400 Caddy for uh, the DVD drive. And all you, you just pull, uh, put in a hard drive and put it right in. And since the entire top of this laptop is metal, it's extremely easy to take apart. Literally, just take off the screws and it comes off. All right, here's that's the review.